So uh, today we'll be checking out our new plugin that's the Magento 2 Multi Vendor Marketplace Pay You Money Payment Gateway plugin. Now using this plugin, the Marketplace store owner can integrate the Pay You Money Payment Gateway into his Marketplace store and thereby can allow the Marketplace vendors to accept the payments online. Now this plugin supports the split payment functionality where the amount is divided between the sellers and the Marketplace store owner at the time of check out itself and the customers can make use of the pay you payment method to pay for the purchases during the checkout with ease so in today's video tutorial I'll be showing you the workflow of this particular plugin at the customers end and I'll be showing you how the customers can make use of this particular payment method to place the orders there using the pay you money and Apart from that, I'll also be showing you the initial configurations uh, required for this particular plugin or the initial configuration settings for this plugin there in the admin backend panel. For more details regarding the option to how to create a test account and how to log in as a child account, you can check the user guide that I've attached within the description of this particular video. Apart from that, for more details for uh, the other options uh, that are available there, you can refer to the user guide as well. And uh, kindly note that this particular plugin is an add-on to the Magento 2 multi vendor Marketplace by Webcool. So you'll have to have that first and then you can make use of this Marketplace Pay You Money Payment Gateway plugin. Also for now, uh, this particular plugin supports the INR currency only or the Indian currency only and uh, the pay you money payment gateway is one of the best payment gateways in India at the uh, at the time right now and kindly note that the admin can refund the invoiced amount partially and fully as required apart from that the admin can manage the refund before or after releasing the payment as well so uh, before I proceed further with the workflow of this particular plugin, kindly do subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to receive the latest updates from our end. Apart from that, if you find this particular video helpful, then kindly do give it a thumbs up. So right now you can see that I've already logged into my customer account and uh, I'm right now in the marketplace store and I've added one product that's the wafer uh, messenger bag. So let's proceed further and let's see the workflow of this particular uh, payment uh, plugin so I'll just tap here on the proceed to uh, check out button as a customer there and here my address is already selected I'll choose the shipping method I'll tap on the next button and here now on the review and payment section under the payment method you can find the pay you money payment uh, method there and the customer can now select this one for making the payment there on the right hand side you can see that we need to make a payment of uh, order total for the 50 rupees there and uh, now let's tap here on the place order button and we'll be redirected uh, to the uh, pay you uh, pay, pay you money payment gateway uh, for completing the purchase there so here you can see that uh, we can make use of the credit or debit uh, card there so we need to make a payment of 50 rupees there now kindly note that right now uh, this uh, payment gateway supports HTTPS only so uh, you'll have to have that first so you need to enter your card details uh, enter the expiry date enter the CVV number uh, go ahead and enter your email your telephone number tap on the pay 51 rupees there 0.51 enter the uh, the OTP there tap on the pay button and we are done making the purchase there using the uh, pay you money payment gateway plugin there as you can see very easily now the customer can view the details of the order as well you can see that the invoice has also been generated here um, under my order section and here if I go to the payment method I had chosen that was pay you money and here's the invoice of my order itself I can tap on that and I can read the invoice of my order as well now uh, the same is visible to the uh, marketplace admin in the uh, backend panel as well and uh, to the marketplace vendors as well now let me take you to the admin backend panel and let me show you the same payment method is visible to the marketplace admin as well so uh, let's log into the admin backend panel by entering my username and my uh, password also kindly note that this uh, plugin also supports the pay you business payment method so you can make use of that as well 
So I'll be showing you the, uh, the workflow of the pay you business uh, payment method uh, in the next video. In this video, I'll just be showing you uh, the pay you money payment gateway plugin. And uh, if uh, there's something missing here in this particular video, I'll surely be adding that up in the other video. Uh, wherein I'll be showing you the workflow of the pay you business payment uh, method itself. So let me close this out and let's go to sales and orders. And here uh, we'll find the order that we have just placed uh, by the customer himself. So here's the order number six. And let's uh, tap here on the view uh, link under the actions column. And now if I scroll down, here you can see that uh, uh, what we say as uh, under the payment information here is the pay you money and the order was placed using the currency that's the Indian currency the INR currency itself now uh, let me take you to the admin backend uh, panel and let me show you the initial configurations for this particular uh, plugin so to do so you will have to navigate through stores and then configuration on the uh, configuration page uh, you'll have to navigate to sales under that you'll have to go to the payment methods under the payment methods you'll have to scroll down and you'll have to go to the other payment methods you'll have to tap that up and under that you'll find the marketplace pay you money payment method as you can see so here we have a few configuration settings so let's go through each of them one by one so the main things that you need to enter here are the method title that is visible to the customers uh, you can enable this particular uh, payment gateway for your marketplace store by choosing a yes Otherwise to disable you can choose a no for that if you have already successfully installed this particular uh, payment uh, gateway uh, Then you'll have to choose the account type whether you want to choose the account type as pay you money or pay you biz so right now we are going through the pay you money so we saw pay you money at the checkout time if i would have selected the pay you biz then we would have seen the pay you biz at the checkout time on the uh, section where we need to select the payment method for the uh, customer there so i'll be showing you that in the next video of this particular uh, plugin itself and uh, after the account type uh, we have the enable testing mode whether you want to use it in a testing uh, mode uh, there or if you want to make to use in the production mode then you can choose it as a no and in the no of or the production mode you can make use of the live credentials there uh, for accepting the payments there and uh, thereafter you have to enter your merchant key your merchant salt uh, before enabling uh, uh, your uh, plugin there you have to enter the merchant authorization key and the admin child merchant ID as well thereafter you'll have to set up your sort order and then you can choose the payment from applicable countries the countries from where you want to uh, basically receive the payments from you can choose them up or you can choose all allowed countries or specific countries and you can choose those specific countries there as per your requirement but the uh, currency that it supports is uh, the Indian INR itself and uh, after you've created your account uh, with the pay you money you'll be getting your merchant key your merchant salt your merchant authorization key and uh, you'll also be able to uh, get your admin child merchant id as well so uh, that was uh, much uh, today for the magento 2 multi vendor marketplace pay you money payment gateway plugin and i hope uh, this workflow of the customer flow there how the customers can make use of their uh, cards there for making the payment using the pay you money gateway plugin uh, was uh, understandable to you and uh, the rest of the configurations there in the admin backend panel as well for the pay you business uh, thing i'll be showing you that in the next video so uh, stay put for that and uh, if you still have any questions queries suggestions or requirements then kindly do reach back to us at support at the rate of webcool.com raise a ticket at webcool.qvdesk.com apart from that if you find this particular video kind of helpful then kindly do give it a thumbs up and lastly thanks for watching this particular video and have a great day ahead